going on YouTube? It's your boy, Mr. Collins, checking back in. And in today's video, we're going to talk about mentality, okay? Mental toughness, grit, really grabbing the bull by the horn. So, about a week ago, I was really having some hard time getting through my training. And, you know, I wasn't hitting numbers I was supposed to hit. And I was really having a hard time getting over 600 on the deadlift. You know, and that's definitely a problem. I being myself a deadlift specialist. And, you know, my coach, I requested that, you know, we take a deload. And initially he said, yeah, let's go for a deload. Let's take it. Let's see what's going on. And after he really sat down and looked at my programming, he told me, hey, with this dealer, we're really going to have to change your goals, what you were looking forward to hitting in your upcoming powerlifting meet. Now, I have big, pretty lofty goals, and hearing that really didn't sit well with me. So he told me on that day that I had to go to the gym and I must hit certain numbers if I wanted to still reach and stay on that path to my certain goals. Now, here's the thing, uh, not to brag, but I've hit, I've hit 700 on the deadlift about two times already in competition, gotten pretty close with 675, 685 outside of competition. So, you know, I know numbers like 635, 645, I know they're within me and I'm able to pull, but I was letting the fear of my previous injury and, you know, not really training heavy for a while really get to me, really get in my psyche. So, one day I was sitting on Instagram and uh, shout out to Dave Tate. Uh, you know, he was constantly talking about how athletes, you know, are needing deloads and constantly uh, wanting to take time off. And I realized that's the case I was in, okay? I haven't been at the point where I should feel run down or overtrained or really having a point of lifting this weight. these weights. It was all mental. It was a combination of fear and just laziness, to be completely honest. So that day, you know, after hearing, you know, from about what Dave Tate was saying and hearing what my coach Demonis said to me, I went to the gym and I ended up pulling a rep PR and a set PR, I guess you could say. I hit 645 for three sets, two reps, and actually on a stiff squat bar. So that really, really showed me that if you really want something and you want to push for it, you must dig deep, okay? In saying that, you know, make sure your nutrition is on point, make sure you're resting adequately and you're hydrated. And if you've hit these things before, you've really worked hard at it, and you know, your program is saying you shouldn't be able to hit it, give it your honest effort. Dig deep, get in that proper mental space, make sure it happens. So I appreciate you guys checking out the video. Uh, just wanted to let you guys know this, brought, this video was brought to you by BPI Sports, and they have a couple interesting flavors here, like, you know, Red Lemonade, Hurricane Orange, which is actually pretty good, and one I haven't checked out yet, the Cherry Lime, okay? These are the BCAAs. Um, I take them myself every day, help keep up with my energy and my strength and my recovery. I recommend you guys do the same, and you can go to bpisports.com, use my code, Joshua C, and get 20% off on your purchase. So. Here comes the end of the video. Check out my new rep and set PR, and I will catch you guys next time. And you'll never see me.